Hey everyone, so today we're going to show you how to upgrade a graphics card in your computer. I built this computer myself in 2021, uh, in November, and I started with just a 1030, because graphic cards were crazy priced, and then I got this 1650, which has worked great. I only play in 1080, uh, my monitor is just 1080 by 60, so this works great, but in some games I'm not getting a full 60 frames, so now I got a 3060, which will be great for me in a 1080. If you want to play in like 2K or 4K, you might want an even stronger card, but that'll work great in 2K, 1440 as well. So all I've done so far is took out screw in the back, and then mine has a little plate to take off. In here, we're going to pull out the card, but we might need this little button usually that I'm going to have to find down here, and it's probably hidden underneath. There we go. So this is the old one. And there was a little button here, push it down. Every motherboard's gonna be a little different. And here I also have a 5800X processor and 32 gigabytes of 3200 megahertz RAM. This is a DDR4 system, AM4. It's one of the last DDR4 systems. It's B550M motherboard. Um, in a few years, I'll probably upgrade to a DDR5 system. But for now, this is plenty for my needs. So all we do is put in the new card push it down to hear a click and it's in there I'll put back on my back plate and then I'll have to screw it in and that's basically the full install now all I'm gonna have to do is plug in my uh, you know my monitor cords and in fact I have one more thing to do and then Nowadays, it's so much easier than 20 years ago when I started building computers. It's almost all plug and play. You can go to a Windows update and get your drivers, or you can go to the, you know, NVIDIA and get the control panel and get the newest drivers from NVIDIA themselves. Either way works good. So my old 1650, it had no power needed. This 3060 has an 8-pin. So I'm going to have to add one cord, and I have my cord here. Plug it into my power supply. And then we'll plug it in to my new video card here. This is a six plus two pin, so I just have to hold it together. Okay, push it down. And it's locked in place. And now that's it. I just got to decide what I'm going to do with this cord. I'll use some zip ties to get it stuck down there put my computer back together and just go and start and run it. So that's how easy it is. If you guys have any questions, let me know. We'll see y'all later.